Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to put together the Runt Rover Whippersnapper. For this project you'll need a Phillips head screwdriver. For the first step we're going to attach our motors to the side plates. Do this by feeding your wires through the square holes in the side plates and then making the output shaft of the motor go through the bottom hole on the side. When you attach your motors, make sure to attach your motors so that they are face up against the rough side of your ABS. You'll go through on each of your motors and attach them all in the same way. Both of the plates are uh, symmetrical and identical so you're not really going to have run into any issues as far as them being different. Um, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through this point until we get to the next step and once we do get to the next step, once you have your motors attached, you can go ahead and we'll continue there. So once you get your motors on, tighten them on with your screwdriver and then we'll meet up at the next step. So I would go ahead and pause the video now and I'm gonna fast forward through this point. Okay, so your next step is going to be to attach this middle plate onto your side plates. It snaps into the, the smooth side of the side plate so that your portion that has two connectors is facing up. And it just snaps in. You do this for both sides. When you put this in, make sure that your wires don't get in and get pinched in between any of your snap parts. Once you have that together, you're going to go ahead and attach this bottom plate. You'll see that your connectors, you have two connectors on each side and then one in the middle. And this plate also has two connectors on the side and one in the middle, either way that you turn it. So that can get kind of confusing, but um, it's really simple. Just the, the side that's rounded will go ahead and be the side that attaches to your plates that have your motors on. After that's together, you just snap your top plate in place. And this plate is, you'll notice it's not really symmetrical like the rest of the piece, but because the rest of the, the kit is symmetrical, it won't matter which way you snap that on. After you have that together, you simply slide your wheels onto the output shaft of each of your motors. And that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy your Runt Rover.